guys and welcome back to the Fans Perspective. In today's video, as you can see, we're well, back at Ashton Gate to see the seven side derby Cardiff City versus Bristol City. The last four times Bristol City have played Cardiff, Bristol City have come out victorious the last three times. So I'm looking quite confident, and you guys are too. 75% of you in the poll believe Bristol City will win. And I'm always confident they played amazing midweek. And they've got a few of the same players, as you can tell by the lineups. Oh, down the start in the Cardiff. We know he's fast, we know he's skillful. But for Bristol City, Hannah Masengo, Bentley, Nathie Wells, you all know they're going to perform. The bookies odds as well. It's pretty much even for Bristol. Five to four for Bristol compared to 12 to five for Cardiff. So even the bookies don't think they're going to do very well. My school prediction personally is a 2 0 Bristol City win. I think Nathie Wells going back on the score sheet. But yeah, at the end of the day, I'm just happy to be here. I'm here with a few of my mates. Uh, I put a few videos up on TikTok and on my Snapchat to see a score prediction. And obviously, if you guys get it right, like every single video now, I'll give you a shout out at the end. But yeah, we're in the stadium. Come on, let's get to kick off. I've heard that it's a sellout today. It's a great show for the Cardiff City fans as well. So, you know, the atmosphere seems good. Let's hope the football can match it. We're taking over the channel today, lads. Some, some perspective. Double head injury, both players have just gone full, full force into each other and they've both been down for a few minutes. So, hopefully, they're okay. Otherwise, we're gonna have some early changes for both sides. Really good chance for Bristol City. It's an excellent through ball. He's taking his time for the 1v1. It's a great save with the goalkeeper. Another rebound to be fair. It was a really tough angle. It was flying up high to him. He tried to go on the end of it and ended up scuffing it. But it's a really good chance for Bristol City. The first big chance of the game. Bristol City technically had their first goal of the game but because Adam was so well the goalkeeper in the back of the head the goal was not allowed the goalkeeper he's gone down twice now the goalkeeper might be making a substitute appearance off the bench but the defence can carry on but Cardiff have got injuries left right and centre here they've already made one substitution due to an injury Bluebirds there, it's a great through ball. He tried to shoot at a strong angle, the keeper got a hand to it, now it's another corner. That's about their fifth and successful. Oh, the first big shot in the card, if they absolutely beat Bristol City's press with the goalkeeper and three centre backs. And the centre back just ran for a team, a beautiful through, through ball in between the centre backs. It was one on one with the goalkeeper, and I don't know if the keeper got a hand to it, but it's gone onto the crossbar. And well, it must have been, what a save, it's a corner.
Liam Gallery equaliser and then the flag goes up. It's still 1 0 to Bristol. Well, but that's a warning sign for the city defence. Okay, so half time team talk. We were looking good for the first half. Obviously, go up 1 0 up. It was a bit of a scare at the end of the half, however. Kyle did get a goal back, but luckily for us, it was disallowed by the offside flag. I'm still going to go with my prediction of 2 0 for full time. But compared to midweek, it's looking like a completely different team. Adam was single with a tap to the other car, but he's still the best player on the pitch by far. Andy Boyd is still putting in the work great. And to be honest, the defence hasn't really had really much to do, apart from pass back to Dan Bentley about 50 million times. So yeah, I'm still going to go for 2 0 for the second half. But for the second prediction, what do you think, Dan? Right, it should be 2 0 up now. But after a tip to the bar, it will end up 3 0 to Bristol. Oh, it's a tough call. Come on, just hope for a Bristol City win either way. Let's get into the second half. Said by the birthday boy at halftime, but we're a completely different side coming up for the second half. We're winning every single draw. Come on, City, we got a call. Section for the next Bristol City game on the 31st. 
We got loads more action this month. We got Bristol, we got Birmingham, as well as a load of other games coming. I've worked out we're going to 11 games in a 30 day period. Absolutely mental. I'll try to keep it too long, but please, I'm trying to shout. So if you're invited to smash that like button, help share the video around, subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so you know when the video goes live. You guys are absolutely mental. At the start of the month, we hit like 1,800 subscribers. We're almost at 2,100 now. It's going absolutely crazy. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. At the score predictions, I don't think anyone got it. But I got it this time. So shout out to me. I think that deserves a subscription. And also, follow me on Instagram. Everything. Links are down below. Any questions or queries, like always, drop it down in the comment section. And I'll try to answer every single one of them. And yeah, without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one. See ya.